Hey, this is Nat, and we're off our couch in Siesta Key, Florida, a barrier island off the coast of Sarasota, and home to the infamous award-winning Siesta Beach. Siesta Beach is popular among tourists, being ranked number one beach by TripAdvisor users in 2015, 2017, and 2020. Siesta Beach has a lot to offer in addition to their famous powdery white sand consisting of 99% pure quartz grains and gorgeous sunsets. Amenities at the Siesta Beach main pavilion include a sun deck, volleyball nets, pavilions, a playground, and Sunday evening drum circles. But if you don't have a need for all of the amenities and you're looking for a beach away from the main pavilion and access point, away from the crowds, and just a calmer, quieter experience, areas, then there's always access point 12 of Siesta Beach, often referred to as Crescent Beach. You can find access point 12 located directly across from Captain Kurt's Crab and Oyster Bar. A lot of this beach area is private um, for the rentals located on the beach, so there are not a lot of parking spaces, but there are some. We are here in early November though, and it is a weekday, so if you are coming during a peak time period or the weekend, I would recommend getting here early to be able to snatch one of these parking spaces. We did see a paid parking lot across the street as well. Plus, there are some bike parking spaces too. I will be exploring other beaches in the area as well, so if you love beaches like we do, be sure to subscribe please. This access point, Crescent Beach, uh, will also lead you to Point of Rocks. Point of Rocks is an ideal spot for beginners, snorkelers, and divers since the water is calm and it's normally just a couple of feet deep. Um, you can possibly see fish, crabs, and even some small sharks, as well as dolphins and manatees. To reach Point of Rocks, once you reach the beach from the parking lot, you want to make a left from what I read. Uh, this says private property on both of these flags, but if you're walking on the coastline, then you're fine to pass through. I'll link the articles in the description box that I'm referring to if you're interested in snorkeling and learning more about that experience. I am heading to the right to enjoy the other amenities available at this beach. This beach is great for birding, fishing, shelling, and wildlife viewing. If you like to shop and enjoy dining out, Captain Kurt's Crab and Oyster Bar in Captain Kurt's Village is right across the way, as I previously mentioned. We did have a chance to check out a couple of the shops within Captain Kurt's Village, but we do want to check out more of this area. So if you have ate at Captain Kurt's um, Crab and Oyster Bar, or shopped at the village, definitely tell us about it in the comments. Uh, so this is a good access point if you do want the quieter atmosphere, the option to snorkel, and still desire access to restaurants and shops. If you stay at one of these rentals, this is your beach. Definitely quieter than the main access points of Siesta Beach. I personally love it when you can walk the beach or sit down at the beach and just hear the ocean without any interruptions like this. And this is still Siesta Beach, so it's beautiful still on the same unique sand, 99% pure coarse grains from the Southern Appalachian Mountains that stays cool to the touch regardless of how hot it is outside. And one of the many reasons why Siesta Beach is such a popular beach. I know I mentioned earlier shelling is a favorite activity here. Although I didn't run across a lot of shells on this part of the beach, I did come across these beauties. And now our beach trip is complete. Thanks so much for joining us on this walk and getting off the couch with us. If you found this video helpful, if you liked this video, please hit the thumbs up button and leave us your thoughts too about Point of Rocks, Crescent Beach, or Siesta Beach. We love to hear your opinions and experiences. Next video, we'd love for you to join us at Turtle Beach, also here in Siesta Key. 
We're going to walk the beach, but we'll also check out the amenities, the surroundings of Turtle Beach, and even get to see manatees. Exciting fun times. We hope you'll join us. Subscribe if you've yet to do so, please. And meet us back off the couch in Siesta Key for the next video. Thanks so much for joining us here at Access Point 12 Crescent Beach. We appreciate all the likes, comments, shares, as well as feedback. And we appreciate you all joining us off the couch so these adventures can continue. Because without all of you, these adventures aren't possible. So thank you. Until next week, click on the video to see another one of our experiences. Thanks for watching.